I'm Shay Cowles covering our HHS senior, Andrea Bird, working at Harrison Animal Clinic. Let's take a closer look at her journey to becoming a veterinarian. I've been in the business for a touch over two years, but I started here as a high school student, as a junior in 2006. Um, so we've always had some high school help around. The plan right now is to continue working at the clinic until I go to college in August um, and I'll be right at my two year mark. I'll be leaving to go to college. I am planning to go to the University of Arkansas and finishing my undergraduate degree in poultry science and then from there the college I'm looking at for my veterinarian degree is Oklahoma State University. I would love to come back here and work under Dr. Jones as a veterinarian. Um, it should be about six to eight years before I am a veterinarian. So who knows the opportunities that are going to open up for me between now and then. But as of now, I plan to come back and work under him. Pi works too much is probably the honest answer. She's persistent, uh, works a ton, always does what, what we need to. Really good worker. So every day is a little bit different, um, but on a normal day I show up at 7.30. We start with taking care of all of our surgeries first. So I will bring surgery patients to the back, um, run blood work beforehand, prep for those surgeries, and then we move on to the middle of the day, which is prepped with busy appointments. Um, so for those appointments, I assist the vet in whatever they need, whether that's running blood, taking a temperature, um, or running x-rays and further diagnostics, and then from there to close the clinic we take care of all of the animals in the back um, so that can be anywhere from like setting IVs uh, running further diagnostics or medicating and treating those animals that are sick in the hospital she does pretty much everything that you can do in this place I've always had a passion for more of a public speaking side of agriculture um, and getting to share the knowledge that I know um, so whether it's being a receptionist at the front desk and uh, taking phone calls and making appointments or or talking to clients about their patients post-op procedures. Um, I think that communicating with the clients about how we help their animals is my favorite part. So when I first got hired here, um, I worked part-time. That was only for about a month and a half. So I worked from one o'clock to close, which is about 5.30 or 6. Um, and then after a month in or so, I switched to full-time and switched to online classes through school. Um, and then so for about a year I've been working here, I've worked full-time uh, Monday through Friday, 7.30 to 5.30, and then every other weekend. This semester, I've taken a break off of work just a little bit to focus on school. Um, so Mondays and Wednesdays I come in at around 10 30 or 11 but the rest of the week is normal. Let's wish Andrea the best of luck in her journeys. I'm Shay Cowles with God TV.